What does it say? Spill the tea. That's what's gonna happen in this video here gonna today. We are gonna spill the tea. Do you ever have a job where you started at like 6 p.m. and yes. for the entire day leading up to that, you just didn't do anything because you're like, I'm gonna start at 6 p.m. I don't know, because I mean, that, that feels like my day daily. <laughs> I know, up? like, I know I have to work today, so I have to do it first, because if I don't, yeah, the whole day's ruined, I might as well, like, eat snacks and watch movies until I get to that point. Weird, huh? That doesn't make any sense. Nah, it doesn't. <laughs> you can just let me, me finish my okay, thought. Okay, okay, you take over. Well, before I finish my thought, first, a word from our sponsor. Oh. Imagine a game. With amazing graphics, brutal boss battles, deep tactical gameplay, and literally hundreds of champions. Imagine this game was available to play for free on both mobile and PC. Imagine this game has been out for five years with over five million active monthly players. And imagine you've heard of the game and you're still not playing it. That's right, I'm talking about Raid Shadow Legends and there's never been a better time to start playing. Raid's currently celebrating their 5th anniversary and have went crazy with the amount of giveaways for new players. Using our link in the description or by scanning the QR code on screen, you will get bonuses worth $100, including the epic champion Lady Atessa, 500,000 silver and much more right from the start. Plus, after reaching level 25, you'll get an additional 500k silver epic skill tomes, potions, and more. And even that's not everything. If you were to use the promo code FESTIVAL5, you'll get another epic champion TRL, another 500,000 silver, and more than that as well. Oh, I wish I had this when I started playing Raid. Be aware though, all these bonuses are only available if you download Raid via our link in the description or by scanning the QR code. Now, what have they been up to the past five years because this game has changed? We've had Doom Tower, Hydrants, Iron Twins, The Sand Devil, Live Arena, <laughs> I love this one, 4v4 PvP with champion picks and bans so you can flex your strategies against other players, mm. Call of the Arbiter, Mythical Champions which are a new powerful ready to champion that can metamorph skills, then the Cursed City, one of Raid's biggest features since the Doom Tower, with 100 stages to complete including stages where you need to take down two of Raid's bosses at the same time. Never mind all of the new champions that are constantly being released. There's also the party happening for Raid's 5th anniversary called the Festival of Creation. So what are you waiting for? Download Raid now and join the party. You can find me in-game under the name Stijo1. Hit the link in the description and we'll see you on the battlefield. What were you saying? What? I don't know. You were talking about yes, something and then I used we to got work. interrupted. I used to work in a bar mm. and uh, I started at 6pm. And I remember my entire day before that was ruined because you were like, well, there's no point in me starting anything substantial because I've got to go to work at six. But did you not feel like you just wanted to sleep most of the day? No. Oh, see, I did. I used to work as a waitress that started I stayed at mom six. and dad at the time, so I didn't really have the choice to sleep most of the day. Uh, well, my mom and dad were at work during the day. Oh, yeah, mom and dad were self-employed. Uh, well, the so. reason I was thinking about that is because we had to, 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 to insert... A uh, 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 sponsor message. Yay! Hype for sponsor message! Make sure you look at them. Um, we had to insert a sponsor message and I was like, well, I don't want to get into anything substantial because there's a sponsor message just coming up. Yeah. And, but then the substantial thing was actually substantiality about unsubstantial things. My head is just not okay today. Like if you asked it, it'd be like, no, it says here, I'm not okay today. Why is your hair not okay? Because it looks Why terrible. Why don't talk about hair? Okay, we're actually recording this just after the previous one, which is why I'm in the same top and why she's changed top. <laughs> um, what is he talking about? I don't know. Did I change just for the video? Yeah. Why are you talking about hair today? Because I hate so I feel hair. like I'm going to get bullied again. You talk about hair. No, because I don't want any squabbles before recording because I, I've learned my lesson on that one. Good. It's not very nice. It's a weird thing. It's not just work. It's appointments as well. Yeah. We had an appointment for me that was at like 6 p.m. If you remember, it was like no. a private appointment. And I managed to get this appointment on the day somehow. Probably because it was private. Mm. Pause. Any... You got lipstick on your teeth. I got lipstick on my teeth. Yes. No! How? I haven't even put any more lipstick on. Eh. Oh, wow. That was a lot. Yeah. 
You know, when you get braces, maybe you don't, but... Was, this I, I intro just is saying, all over I the place. I was just pause so we can cut it out, but if you're happy enough to have this in... Listen, I don't care. These... Oh, I've just made it worse, look. Oh, no, I can see it. I can't get that bit off now. If you've ever had braces, they tell you don't wear lipstick because it just goes on your Invisalign. I think we're good. Yeah, you're safe. Yeah, and it just, like, gets stuck in between, like, the little gaps that you've got for your attachments anyway thank you thank you very much for that you're welcome a very kind partner would always tell you you got a little satin there on your face or so that's that's very very kind of you i remember we watched a show or, so, or something like that about um something along those lines but it was like a barista at like a coffee shop who had like they intentionally put something between her teeth to see if anyone would say if anyone would say yeah and did they no what? I'm like, I I would tell you. See if it was in Baddison as well, like you got a little there. I'd, I'd tell you. You got a bit of spinach between your teeth. <laughs> so yeah, I don't know why. I think it's because you don't want to be late for your work. You don't want to be late for your appointment or that. So your I, brain just shuts down. Yeah, I think you don't, you don't like to be interrupted if you start getting into the flow of doing something. And that's what you meant by we don't want to get too much into a conversation at the start of the video because we were about to be interrupted. The flow would be interrupted. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I see where you're going. This intro was all over. That's right. It was a, it was a bit of a it was a bit of a meta conversation because it was talking about how you don't like to start anything substantial, but the talking about starting something substantial was because you didn't want to start any conversation that was substantial. Can we just talk about the fact though, like? We haven't had sponsorships on this channel before. Not on this channel. We that is are the first like one. we are going up in the world. I feel like it's a high great, five. Yeah. I feel like it's a great first sponsor as well. It's very, very telling. <laughs> <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> God, I was like the sponsor. Yeah. So thank you, thank you very much. Yes. Thank you. Um. Thank you. <laughs> Quite finished. Yeah. Have I got any more? No, you're fine. You're all right. I just keep getting paranoid. So in the last episode of Breaking Bad, we Jesse actually... Jesse and Walt fight. We punch up. I know. I love the relationship between Jesse and Walt, though. It is like a weird father and son. You probably shouldn't treat your son the way that he treats Jesse, but it, it kind of is like a fatherly son kind of thing, and I kind of like it. I like their dynamics. You think, you think Walt's going to get through to Jesse and straighten up his act and no. make him make him a good uh, contributing member of society? No. By making drugs. I think he's going to make him like the top drug man. You know what's funny, right? Oh, Jesus. Just think, just thinking. Sponsors are mad. He's all over the sponsor. <laughs> no, just like, thinking, just because, just because this is like. We're talking about drugs and fighting and people getting murdered and stuff. And they're like, we want to sponsor that. <laughs> You're mental. You know what? We, we really like you guys. Yeah. Like, yeah, let's just Crazy. chuck our name Crazy. in with you guys. Yeah. Yeah, let's see how that does. <laughs> <laughs> All right. If you want to watch this unedited with us, make sure you head on over to suzylou.co.uk or the Patreon. The link is in the down here somewhere. It's down here. Um, I just wanted to say, I don't like Skylar. I know. I kind of, I wanted to feel bad for her for the fact that she doesn't fully know what's going on, but she's being kind of left in the dark by her husband, which isn't very nice. I know, she's going about it in the wrong way. sparked up while preggers. Girl, yeah. I'm over you. I'm over you. Do you think that that child deserves to come into the world like that? Huh? Do you think... Did okay. I deserve that, Mom? <laughs> Here's right. one, right? Do you think that that's going to have any controversy in the comments of the last episode? What do you mean? Do you think there'll be people that are like, Oh, it's totally fine! No. Like, no. people high on their own copium? No. Oh, I think you might. Oh, no. You might. Like, okay, so yeah, we are filming this before we've posted the last one. There's no way! I think we might. No one's that stupid. I think, we might, I think they might be like, oh, it's so overblown. I smoked during my six pregnancies and they were all fine. Are got they extra, They've got extra toes because my husband's actually my brother. <laughs> <laughs> and no, I'm not looking at you, Alabama, because I got into trouble for saying that last time. <laughs> 
<laughs> Just remember, this video is sponsored. Somehow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right you guys i did i just like uh scarlet that's her new name scarlet, apparently. scarlet johansson that's um, very nice i'm sorry but we all are allowed to have things that we like and dislike and for me to smoke him while you're pregger is like ew it's not cute no i think i don't care how stressed you are i think the vast majority of people would probably be in agreement with you there good because if you're not you're wrong anyway bring bad bring bad let's go jesse jesse well, I think that went well. <laughs> that went well. Listen, you can sponsor my channel all you want, but I'm still going to be me, you know? Oh, yeah. Yo! How poignant for what is going on right now in the United States. What, people swimming in dirty water? Uh, the border crossing. That was a joke, by the way, before anyone's like, she is so <laughs> stupid. I actually watched a, a video on YouTube of someone, like an investigative journalist, doing this exact thing. And then getting arrested for illegally crossing into the United States. <laughs> it was just a YouTube video. Right, whose glasses are here? Oh, that's gooey. The teeth! Oh what my god! Okay, why are they? Yeah, why? What's happened to Hank? Oh shoot! Hey, they'd be worth a, a few bucks. I know, huh? Couple of quid. There's no way that Hank would lose his prized possession like that, though. Where would he have it for it to end up, like, in the river, though? Maybe his car ends up in a, a river and they, like, go downstream or something. I want to blow something up. Do you ever get that urge? I think that would definitely get us a visit if I started blowing stuff up. Well, I set fire to a lot of things. It's not illegal. The neighbours just don't like the smoke when they've got their washing out. Yeah, and explosions are just fires, but slightly faster. Yeah. I wonder how his treatment's going if he's literally got no money right now. Well, I gave Jesse half. So he's still got money. This makes me so sad. I, I didn't know it was like this. I thought it was a very personal private, world. personal matter. Nah. I think it is. They tend to, like, chat with each other and, you know. Hmm. We'll check back in two months, see how you responded, reassess, and decide our next move, if any. That's uh, right around the time the babies do, correct? Ooh. Uh, you'll start feeling better soon, more like yourself. And your hair should start to come back. Keep it short. I've kind of gotten used to the old cue ball look. I prefer to think of it as streamlined. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's an efficient haircut. No more confusion. No more. No. No. <laughs> no. 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 How are you two holding up? Um. Well. She's actually here, but she's oh, like no. invisibility jutsu, you Is know. But. Nerd. <laughs> Absolutely. I was about to say cloak invisibility. <laughs> <laughs> Nerd. Such a shame. So, we're not going through an insurer, is that correct? Yes, direct bill. As long as at the vet. I just need to print it out for you. Hi, <laughs> 20 grand, that's about right. Oh my god, I used to eat that paper. You know the bits on the side, it's so tasty. That explains a lot. Like the the holy stuff. It's proper tasty. One day. No, no one day. Not the pink paper though. That's not. It's a bit sugary. <laughs> Shut up. I thought we had discussed a cash discount. Absolutely, it's included. Oh. Quality. We do have a payment plan available. Should you be interested? Oh. So tell me then, how much is that costing you? Okay. Uh, no, no. Congratulations. Thank you. Congratulations, you think, got a badge? I don't think a doctor should be giving people badges that say hope is the best medicine. <laughs> That's almost as bad as when I got Animal Farm stickers when they were poking my eyes constantly as a kid. It's like saying you can pray the cancer away. <laughs> uh, you know, it, it should be covered. You bet I will, yeah, in triplicate. Okay. 
Well, I'm sorry you couldn't be of more help, too. Yeah, okay. Oof. Takes, Takes one, one and no one. one. <laughs> God, is someone who smokes? No. Oh! The hospital bill came. That was fast. Yeah. Three day stay, 13,000 and counting. Wow. Your granny was in hospital for like oh, eight we, weeks. No, no. Oh, yeah, when she was in uh, is intensive this care. That uh, Gretchen and Elliot might cover. Oh. I, uh, I know it's strictly your domain, oh. but. Um, they will. I, I'm sure they will. I'll handle it. How much was it? Should I say 13,000? 13,000. That was an expensive hospital. Uh, I get no, a new car for I was going to say that's an expensive hotel and then hospital will come out. Me and you, man. We are on the same wavelength. What? We, we say the same things. Been around each other too long. Yeah. What's going on under his light? That was strange. Oh, well, whatever is going on outside. Aliens. Wouldn't know. Can't remember the last time I went to bed and it was dark. <laughs> we strapped it all back down again. Yeah. I just love that there's a gun in there. It's like, if it's not weird enough that someone would find just heaps of cash, there's also a gun there. <laughs> even more suspicious. Well, the gun has to protect the cash. It's like he's been going out robbing banks or something. So he's almost done then with his treatment. Yeah, his first round. Oh. Do we know how many rounds? Oh, he needs more money. It's alright, the RV's outside, is it not? I'm sure Jesse's driven away somewhere. Where's that guy when you need him, huh? The one that Hank got arrested, the nice guy. Oh, yeah. The, in the school. The janitor. Ready to help you out in your home if need be. <laughs> Oh my god, it's not just hideous light switches, they've got hideous powerpoints as well. Why'd you have a powerpoint in your bathroom like that? You're not gonna shave on the floor. So you can take a TV in, so you can you can have a really good jobby. Watching Bright and Bad. What is, what is that? that? Oh, packet of fags. Why would you put them down the toilet? Put them in next door's bin or something. That's so dumb. That is dumb. And I thought putting baby wipes down was stupid. I bet she blames it on Walt Jr. Sorry, what's his name? Flynn. That's what my auntie's dog is called. Flynn. Flynn Ryder. Uh, so things are quiet, you know? Not a lot of crystal on the streets right now. Good. And of course, that's not gonna last. Uh, Waiting to see who's gonna rally the roaches now that his turf's up for grabs. Power vacuum. Yep. Well, we keep hearing the name uh, Heisenberg. Lately, pretty much every dime bagger we come across. Yeah. Where the hell did you hear that from? Still, somebody somewhere is cooking that big blue we keep finding. Anyway, uh, we'll stay on it. Where could he have possibly heard that? That's what we were saying. Just all the druggies are all say saying it. How does Albuquerque liaison Tri-State Border Interdiction Task Force sound? Like one hell of a promotion. As of the first, I want you to split your time between here and El Paso. Oh. Okay, so that explains why he might be in a different place with the teeth. No, El Paso is Texas, is it not? Hey, you want to grab lunch? <laughs> oh, hell yeah, because you're buying. Done. I'd be like, can you put my teeth down, please? Here's the man. That's good. Well done, Hank. Well done. I do like Hank, you, you shoot know. shoot a drug dealer in the head. That guy looks like Master Roshi from Dragon Ball. He really did. Oh, oh my, my god. god. <laughs> He's real. <laughs> Show him again. <laughs> Is that a Bulma here too? Uh, you know, I gotta say it. I'd be so sad if anything happened to Hank. I know, he's great, isn't he? Yeah, he's a sweetheart. Uh oh. Oh no. Why did you say anything? I, oh, I haven't seen this before, I promise. You caused this. It's okay, it's just motion sickness, it'll pass. Is he having a heart attack? Oh, PTSD.
Well, that's why you, ju you heard the thing in the background. The lowrider. Give me a four. Oh, Hank. She did say, what's the wife called? Marie? Marie. When she was on the phone and they asked her, how is he holding up? Mm. And he was looking quite oh, she's like, oh, down. Hank. You know, yeah. he wasn't looking exactly thrilled about the situation. Well, for God's sakes. I bet he never expected that. Yeah, are you kidding me? He's going to give him the money because his words is bond. Jesse! His outfit, man. I love it, I man. I nerve coming back here. What's like he's wearing his big brother's clothes? Balance for the, uh, the tow, the repairs, and extra for... The gate? <laughs> Look, like I said, my word is my bond. See? You got it. Well Listen, done, Jesse. give him some back. Your toilet was broken anyways. It was blue! It's the stuff you put in. That much? If you don't want to be smelly. What would you charge me to store this here? Million five. Come on, yo. Your sister. Dog, I'm serious, all right? I got storage needs. And I got scratch up front. Mate, you would just sell your stuff. You know how much the methylamine's worth? 500. A month? A week. What? Get a brand new house and a mortgage for less. Just go to the desert. Your fence is too easy to climb. Inside, padlocked, plus gate privileges. Come again. Gate, in and out, privileges. Month to month, cash up front. Like, you are gonna cook with this guy floating around though? That's just asking for I know, it. you're trusting like, someone else here. That is not. And he knows how much this stuff is worth. Yeah, but if you're getting two grand a month. You selling? Oh! Why you take it for nine Gs? <sighs> Does it bounce? What about that one? Serious? <laughs> oh, God. Well, oh, come on, I want to oh, see what I it looks like! Oh! Yeah. What? That is drug dealer if I ever seen it. What are you talking about? All the drug dealers drive Range Rovers. Come <laughs> on, nonsense. Well, I wouldn't know that, would I? Well, for rent, one bedroom, very clean. Sorry. Very clean, not just clean. Jane, right? Well, Jane, I gotta say, this place is awesome. He's getting back on his feet, I love it. Um, I had an entire house before, detached and all, but you know, I was just tired of the lawn care, upkeep and whatnot, you know? Yeah, I feel you on that. This house is filthy. You got a cable? Already wired, just call to activate. High speed, whatever. Bathroom, cool tile. Bedroom. Nice. This is just far too clean right now for Jesse. I don't know. Give him a week though. You're interested? Definitely, definitely, yeah. And you're good with MPNF? Uh, uh, what, what? What was MPNF? In the ad? No smoky, no pets? You want a smoky dude outside? Uh, oh, okay. no, yeah, 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 no. What about. Creating meth, is that um, all right? Or a recent pay stub, current employer, former address, you know, the yada yada. And if it's all copacetic, I'll call. Is self-employed? Thing is, I can... Unbelievable. Like I'm just currently in between situations. Then I'm currently not renting. Look, look, I got the money and I'm totally good for it, for like ever. <laughs> That's uh, steep. Pen on paper, that's what I need. Or go run your game somewhere else. Dude, I got nowhere else to go. This is it. And I got no game, all right? I just need a chance. Come on, everyone needs a God chance. Go trust, Je trust Jesse. His words is bond. Uh, Look at his outfit, man. Apparently, didn't meet their expectations. Again. So, you know, now I'm persona non gratis or whatever, but you know what? I'm persona non grata, but. <laughs> But I will pay you every month, and I will pay you on time. I will not mess this up, okay? I swear. Like, money's money at the end of the day. Who cares? What? Rent just went up. What would you rather, Jesse or some old guy with a pooch? No pets. In addition to first and last, I want two more months. DBAA fee, non-refundable. Yeah, of course. No problem, DBAA. 
Obviously, yeah. What's DBA? What's what's DBA? Douchebag what? Don't be an. Oh, don't be an. Gotcha. I love you. I live next door. Really? Oh. I'll fill it in. Just sign your name. Which is what, by the way? It's Jesse. I, uh, Jesse Jackson. Robots. I see Jesse you. Jackson. What? Why are you blaming him? He didn't, you know, give himself his own stupid name. <laughs> Jesse Jackson. <laughs> I'm JJ, yo. <laughs> if he thinks he's going to be able to cook in there, but she lives next door. No, I don't think so. Oh, this is... I was like, wait a minute, but they're making beer. Let it be straight around. Straight around. I'm confused. What? Well, you would think that Hank would have already had some sort of experience on the field. Yeah, probably, but... But it's interesting that that's the one that seems to have set him off a wee bit. Uh-oh, what did I do? You call in sick. The day after receiving a long-awaited career-boosting promotion, so you can play Oktoberfest in your man cave. I mean, listen, babe. If you ever want to do that, you go right ahead. He needed a day. I can't call on sex Please though. Don't tell me. You, you can phone your office and let no, it know. No, I hate that. Nobody can do my job. I can take a day. No big deal. Now, get that sweet out of here so I can concentrate. <laughs> She's not very nice to him, is she really? No. If that was me and I was able to drink, I would just be like, all right, crack them open. Can't come into work today. You know, just, <laughs> I'm good fun, me, you know? I'm not like the other girls. I'm not like the other girls. I'm so different. I hate those things, man, because I can just picture these bloody bottles exploding in your hand. Do not like. Gives me the heebie-jeebies. He clearly just needs to like... Oh, oh I told you! Oh. <laughs> You've no. seen this before! Oh, I just... Oh, I hate them. He clearly just needs a day, though, to like... take his mind off things. Yeah. If it's got blood, you might be like... Ugh. No, I just don't. Do you have to hold it while it goes on it? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, but the way it was... Oh, stick inside. Because I would just... A caterpillar. I would just be like that, and then I, I wouldn't uh, hold it, you know? I would just like... Mine is much cooler. Yours is the Lord of the Rings. Mine says Elvish. Harvey. Finally, we're going to get some cooking. It's actually been ages. Like, the show's been really focusing on relationships. Going good and bad. Yeah. But we currently have nobody to sell to. I want to see more of the Breaking Bad bit. His outfits. Yeah. Iconic. The plan is we cook. Why are we cooking when we can't even move what we cook? I thought that was your job, Jesse. I mean, you could make a batch of fairy cakes, take them into town, and people would buy them. Meth is no different. Don't you get that? A DA's up my a No, I'm, I'm not exposing myself to that level of risk for chump change. No way. Then what do you suggest? Just hire some I don't think either salesmen. of us are eager to jump into bed with another Tuco. Get your buddy on board. What's he called? The Final Fantasy voice guy. Baxter, Bouncer. Bouncer. You've got bills? Rent, yo, responsibilities. Badger. Badger. I've already lost more than I've made, and I'm tired of being around out here. You want to know how much I've got left? Oh, this isn't a competition, guys. Zero. Zip nothing. Oh. I've got nothing to show for all of this. Nothing for my family, which, as you might remember, was the whole damn point. <laughs> Calm down, Walt. You don't get anywhere by shouting. We go into business with yet another homicidal lunatic, or you and I start. What? You selling whatever you can. Homicidal lunatic seems like the best move. Wendy's probably got a bit of cash. We got to be Tuco. All right, cut out the middleman, run our own game. So you're going to what? Snort meth off a Bowie knife? Oh, you're gonna you gonna beat your homies to death when they diss you? Nobody <laughs> says he has to be the same, Tuco. We 
control production and distribution. That way we stay off the front lines while moving some serious glass. I mean, the point here is to make money, right? Sky high stacks. Um, that, that seems like a lot of exposure. Did he ever think to wear a mask when he does it? <laughs> I don't vote for this plan. I'm not comfortable bringing in unknown entities into our operation. Yeah? Well, you don't get to vote. Why? This is a partnership, remember? I rem oh, I remember. Well, you keep now saying you that, cook, Walt, but then you say I otherwise as well. Was division of labor when we started all this. And that's exactly how we should have kept it. It was your idea to go to Tuco, though. Well, we didn't know that Tuco was going to be such a <laughs> psychopath, though. In any case, it's not going to happen that way anymore. Yeah, damn straight. Know why? Because we do things my way this time. <gasps> or I walk. Oh, Jesse. Jesse's getting some balls up in here. Yo. I need you, Walt. Good for you, Jesse. Okay, I thought something was leaking in my house. <laughs> oh, I love pretzels. I like the white ones though. You mean the white chocolate pretzels? Yes. He's having a party. Look at him. It's oh. going up in the world. Oh. It's from my class, uh, he was getting people's up, brother. What up with it, yo? Hey, combo, good to Wait, see you. Wait, not these guys oh, again. No. I didn't trust these guys the first time. <laughs> yo. Oh, Badger! Oh, cool crib, man. His voice is just so funny hey, to me. It echoes. Hello? It's because there's nothing in it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me give you a virtual tour, okay? So Plasma, it's gonna go right here. It's a really nice place, actually. I like the design on the ceilings. But the picture's like way sharper. Blacks are deeper too. They got 3D coming out like any day now. Oh my God. Frickin' 3D, bad one. I remember these. 2024. I remember these conversations with like so talking about plasmas and LCDs. And... For like right here, you know, for your ultimate viewing comfort. Those are Burt. Uh, Those are what now? I have no idea. Burt. Burt. <laughs> the ladies, they cream up real nice for like candles and <laughs> <laughs> You are going to score big time. <laughs> <laughs> Jesse's kind of like, well, the girl next door is not bad. No, no, no. No bomb, no beer, no weed. All right, you smoke it up on your own time. We're talking business here. Okay? So why, why am I here to goes. drink Coke? I front you know, Coke. You. Pretzels. Pretzels, and have you got any jelly and ice cream? All right, everybody and their mother's going to want to taste. And second, who else is selling right now, huh? It's dry out there, that's for sure. That's so, what you so you point Beggars out can't be choosers. Like quarter, half, teen, or whatever. I can't imagine it ever actually being dry <laughs> in a place like that. This is a big opportunity I am giving you. Understand. Badger, what is this? Um, big opportunity. A big opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> Gentlemen, how far you go is up to you. See, Jesse no, ain't so no. stupid. No, no, no. Like, he's going Not full here, businessman right? here. Ever. Yep. Blind drop. I will let you know when and where. So, all right, I'm going to eat some Pringles. You're not in my house. There is always more. Okay. I'm excited. I, I guess. Right. Yep. Apply yourselves. TPAA. <laughs> yeah. I don't trust Badger. No, no, die, Jesus. Nah, there's something about Badger, man. I mean, he, he shot at him. Are we just forgetting that that happened? I feel like, yeah, yeah, something's going down, but like, Badger is useless. He literally shot at him, left him then in the desert, and it's like, why would Badger even come back? Ah, you know. Friendships are weird. That's such like an iconic American vehicle that I've never seen in this country ever. <laughs> Oh, he's checking the, uh... It's an armpit. It's not an armpit. What's it called? <laughs> Ashtray. Mm. Oh, we're cars with ashtrays. It's the Paris of the Southwest. Please, it's Texas. Yeah, it was clean, though, wasn't it? Sake. Well, it is Texas. I was right. I'll pass it. Mexican hell. Human heads. <laughs> they leave. The cartels, they litter the place with human heads. This isn't the 1900s. No, I mean, they do, though. I do think Calling Carter a shout-out or something. Now, DC, on the other hand, I could get behind. If she was my auntie, I would rip into her so hard. Like, <laughs> I, I could never George take her seriously. 
Enjoy your smoke. Just letting you know. I know. You have a Jaeger bomb? <laughs> I was talking to Melinda, Hank's boss's wife. I told you about her, the one with the helmet hair and the permanent lip liner. Anyway, she was saying that when they were there, they... Shh. <laughs> I was gonna say, how can you not read the room, Murray? Oh. I will not listen to one more word until you apologize. I mean, you probably should. For... Don't even dare, Murray. You know. Clear lies to me. I can't Shot believe she still hasn't apologized. All of it? Poor Skylar, though. Sister's lying to her. Husband. Husband. If you hadn't tried to return it. Apologize. God, so hard. No, I'm or so never. weak. I mean it. Or it'll never be the same. I mean, you're having to force her to do it. Why are you punishing me? Oh my <laughs> God. Don't you're a terrible person. Me. Enough to apologize, to tell me the truth, and I know you just you neck that. Just apologize. Why are you doing this to me? I need my sister back. Your sister's in therapy for being a thief, honey. She's a tea leaf. I'm sorry. Okay, let let's judge this now. Let's rate the apology. I'm sorry. I think it's pretty sincere. I'm mm -hmm. kind of feeling it a wee bit. You want to take more details? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, you don't. Keep you up at night. Mm. Was it scary? Hell yeah, it was freaking scary, you little punk. Guy shooting at you. But you were way faster than him. Ah, uh, teenagers just don't understand, do they? No. You know what it is? Cockroach comes out from under a fridge. What do you do? You step on it. We don't get cockroaches in this Where country. Where do you come from? Nope. Thank, thank God. Criminals like the one you... Uh... <laughs> what do you think it is that makes them who they are? <laughs> Buddy, you might as well be asking me about the roaches. All I know, there's a whole world of them out there. Yeah. I just keep feeling like this is traitors. You're talking to a traitor! <laughs> You squish one and then a million other come out of the woodwork. Well, actually, I heard that cockroaches can't die. Is that correct? I don't know. They just keep coming back. Hey! Oh, ladies! <laughs> Everyone's looking for that next hit, oh, aren't they? That, yeah. I'm really surprised that Jesse didn't go for a similar car to what he had. But, he could afford it. Uh, I was going to say, maybe he was worried it would make him too suspicious. Nah, not Jesse. I hope this works out for Jesse, but I know it ain't gonna. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty! This music's very loud. <laughs> I know, I just asked him to turn it up because I couldn't hear it, and now it's like, I'm, I can't hear you! <laughs> <laughs> and then everybody's happy. Do you think that this show in a way, glorifies the drug world. No. No? No, not at all. Just kind of scenes like this, where they're all like, oh, look how easy we make it. And then I think like, when it's going well, sure. But, you know, it's went badly quite a few times for them. Yeah. And they're in life oh, and the death baldies. a lot. Was that the, the Aryan Brotherhood? See, the Baldies are the Nazis, it's difficult to tell sometimes. It's such a shame when you look at, like, the women mm -hmm. that they're showing in this as well. Oh my god! Oh, oh skinny no. Pete! This oh no. Good. This isn't gonna be good. It's a tarp. What's a tarp? Oh, she's... No! Oh my god, I thought he was gonna... She looks like from that Wrong Turn movie. <laughs> you ain't gonna get any more if you kill him. You need to get harder, Skinny Pete. You need to know what happens when someone f with you. You need to take them out. And also, could you see the cops? Like, don't just run, you know? Don't just believe. I gotta believe. 
she was terrifying. Like she was terrifying. She really was like, yeah. sign out of that <laughs> creepy movie. What's a tarp? <laughs> it's a trap with the letters switched around. Ah. <laughs> Wasn't sure it was you. Yeah, look how clean his car windows are. Keeping things in the DL. I'm guessing this one doesn't bounce. Listen, <laughs> you can buy things to make it bounce. 15K. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, you're welcome. Jesus. Help me understand the math, okay? Uh oh, here we go. You and I split $2,000 per ounce. $1,000 each. One pound. That's 16 ounces. 16 ounces should net to me $16,000. 16. thousand short. Something came up. Something came up? Oh yeah, Skinny P got mugged. Lost an ounce, but it's cool. Okay, Skinny P's cool. <laughs> I mean, it's not cool necessarily, but also you should have told Walt. He shouldn't have to dig on that. Dude, it's called breakage. Okay? Like Kmart breaks. And you're thinking this is acceptable. It's the cost of business, yo. Make sure the junkies know who they're dealing with. I'm just the chemist here. I'm not the street guy, yo. <laughs> but it seems to me that what you call breakage is just you making a fool of yourself. Ooh. What happens when word gets out and it's open season on these clowns you've hired, huh? Once everyone knows that Jesse Pinkman, just rob them. drug yep. lord, can be robbed with impunity. Well, yeah, and if anything, you want the status of Tuco. Yeah. He broke bones. He broke the skull of anybody who tried to rip him off. You want another grand? Is that it? No, he wants you to harden up. He wants a better reputation. It's not about the money. Well, that's it. Does he need to... Look, you got 15,000 you didn't have yesterday. Hey, we're making bank happens. He's not getting it. He is not getting it. Nope. And you're all tucked in tonight with your precious family. So why don't you just stop being such a freak about everything? You made the division of labor very clear. Yo, I mean, seriously, what the hell do you want me to do? Does he need to just toughen up, sell you the pound and get 16 grand off of you and you can have your breakage. Yeah, as long as it have doesn't to do impact him. him. Yeah. yeah. I didn't like the way that he had to be the one to find out the information. That's not good partnership. No, that you find out the information by Getting being short. Off. Yeah. Yeah. Don't, because my, oh, stomach, is, oh, <laughs> so my stomach is still... Oh, I'm looking forward to dinner. My stomach is still... Oh, I'm so hungry. <laughs> Macaroni balls! Sounds like an STD. <laughs> what you eating? Um, panini. There's another one in the freezer if you want it. Hey, if you're enjoying this reaction, remember to subscribe. We haven't ever done that before. Yeah, I mean, aren't those the ones with the off-the-chart sodium? I had a craving. Once in a while, it's no big deal. Well, like cigarettes? Mmm. Should be eating the cigarettes. So where's Junior? God, I hate their relationship, man. Isn't I found cigarettes. I know. Lewis. Is your back sore? Out where? <laughs> Sorry. Somewhere. Do you know why to be comfy? And I just thought you might have a clue where your son is. Whoop! <sighs> why not you? Your son as well? Ouch. I'll tell you what, Walt. You want to know where he is? Ask him. Just pick up the phone like I do. What's the matter where he is? He's, 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 give him his privacy. Well, I don't think he wants to believe that she's smoking. So maybe he thinks it's him. No, I think he knows. Perhaps you might know something about this. There you go. Perhaps. Mm -hmm. And then again. Perhaps I don't, Walt. Oh, she's I'm such a cow! State. Oh. I'd like an explanation, oh, please. You I really mean, don't want to go. Why down would you do this? Wall. You're pregnant, for God's sake. Three and a half cigarettes is not going to do a thing. It's still disgusting. It's no excuse. I know. 
I tossed the rest, and I'm sure you'll be very glad to hear that, yes, I feel ashamed. I'm also so glad I had to get them out of the toilet that you blocked. <laughs> it's fine smoking when you're pregnant, just don't block a toilet. No, thank you. No thank you is what I think to this relationship, you mofo. That's not very nice. Well! Listen, if you're giving Walt the benefit of the doubt for having cancer and being a bit weird, yeah, you, you've got... Oh, that gave me a fright. I think that's his PTSD. Hank. Oh, bless him. Uh. Like... Ain't nobody doing this in your house, you know? Especially with the same sounds over It sounds like they're shooting bloody... Bottles. His balls. Oh, Jesus, woman! Oh, it, it is his balls. Over pressure, yeah. Going off. What an idiot she is! Why, yeah, why would you go in that way? You follow him from behind! You don't, he's got a gun! <laughs> you don't! Let him clear. Well, then I'd be stupid because I'd be like, I'm just coming behind you. <laughs> as long as you keep a hand on my shoulder. Yeah. God, man. That would suck. Well, that's it. You're already terrified because of like shooting Tuco and now your bottles are going off sounding like gunshots. You can't be here, Walt. This is my, <laughs> my house. house. Yeah. <laughs> you could have at least come with a you TV. You asked me what I want you to do. That t-shirt is horrible. <laughs> I want you to handle it. Breaking bad! <laughs> that's it, I've had enough. You need to, Jesse, if that's the guy you want to be, be that guy. Okay, okay, okay. Obviously, the mouth. obviously we don't approve of this. Everything okay. is just commenting on the show. It's what we see in front of us, you know. Don't go and do drugs, kid. Kid. Jelly beans is New specific fine. kid. Ah, so he just launches it. That's interesting. So he's not proud of it. Yeah, his, his like, yeah. Because of what it's done to him, it I went guess, from... I think it's more what it represents. So I think the, the conversation between Walt Jr. and him... Oh, so cool, man. You yeah, killed like, someone. Yeah, it's like, no, it's not. It's not cool, actually. Wow. Oh, poor Hank. He always did in the beginning come across as the guy who was untouchable in that respect, like mentally. Yeah. And like, it was all funny. Like, you remember the first episode where he's like, guns, 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 you know, at the yeah. party to now where he's like, I've killed someone and this doesn't feel so good. Yeah. Regardless to who they were, it doesn't feel good. And he's left with the emotional scars. Yeah, he's like, I don't, we shouldn't really be celebrating. Yeah. Yeah, so. Oh. Oh, Hanky. Poor Hank. I nearly shot Marie. He nearly shot Marie. Well, I mean, deserved, let's be honest. <laughs> Jeez Louise. All right, guys, make sure that you check out... The QR code for Raid Shadow Legends. Is that in the description? Uh, it's here. And what what can they do with that? They scan it with a phone and you can download Raid Channel Legends and get all the, the, the goodies that we talked about at the start. Thanks a lot for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye bye. But we always tell them that we hope we have their fantastic oh, Jesus. <laughs> do we? We always tell them have a fantastic weekend because the weekend is for chill time and horrible dance music on the radio. I don't have to do. Always say this. I don't. Tell them about the Bye bye. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Scooch. <laughs>